Meow. Here, get comfy. God damn it, Sans. Mm -hmm. How's it going, everyone? My name is Swingpoint, and welcome to what I'm guessing is going to be one of the funniest damn things we ever see on this channel in terms of video games. We just got done with the Papyrus battle, and now what we have to do is go into Papyrus' house and go on our date with him. We're playing Undertale right now, in case you didn't already catch the drift. And now we need to go on our date that we were promised by Mr. Papyrus here. <laughs> How's it going? Welcome to Scenic My House. Enjoy and take your time. So, I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at all the shit in this house, because I'm sure it is freaking hilarious. It's a joke book, oh god. Take a look inside, obviously. It's <coughs> inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. <laughs> what else we got in here, Mr. Papyrus? The great Papyrus. I'm, I would... Oh! It's my, it's my favorite game show. <laughs> it says stay tuned for new program, MTT. What? This is usually better than this. It's just a bad episode. <laughs> Don't judge me. I would assume that Sans lives here too. I'm really excited to like just explore this stupid ass house. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. I can't finish any of their voices because I just start laughing. The rock is covered in sprinkles. He forgets that. What do you feed it? Your spaghetti? It's a dirty sock filled with a series of notes in it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down, move it! <laughs> okay. You moved it two inches! Put it in your room! <laughs> okay. And don't bring it back! <laughs> okay. It's still here! Did you, did you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it! <laughs> oh, never mind the TV, I'm sorry. Okay, let's see what's in here. Is this your, this is your kitchen? Okay. You seem pretty... Pretty concerned about me walking in your kitchen. What's up? No? Okay, well, I'm gonna take a peek around at some stuff in here. What's in your fridge? Aha! Interested in my food museum? Oh, you probably don't eat because you're a skeleton. Duh. Please! Peruse my culinary art show! Half of the fridge is filled with containers of labeled spaghetti! <laughs> the other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Okay, what's in your trash can? That's the trash can! Feel free to visit at any time. Okay. Why is your sink so tall? Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. <laughs> what? Catch that meddling gate! <laughs> Curses. Sans, what are you doing over there? Sans, stop plaguing my life with incidental music. <laughs> what else is in here? Anything? What's your stove? My brother always goes out to eat, but... Recently, he tried baking something. It was like a quiche, but filled with sugary non-egg substance. How absurd! Okay, I, 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 anything else in here? Forget it. Okay. <laughs> well, let's go ahead, take a little bit more of a peek around. What's this? A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. Your bones? Okay, I need to see what's going on here with Sans. The door is locked. That's all it says? What's going on in Sans' room, man? Seriously, there's like a portal in there? What the hell is that? Okay, well, let's go over here. That's my room. If you finish looking around, perhaps we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. <laughs> yes, let's go inside. Dude, he's got a race car bed. Oh my god. Okay, now we gotta look at all this stuff in here because it's all so funny. Papyrus is probably one of the funniest characters in the game. Sans is like the jokester, but I think Papyrus is way funnier so far. Hey! Those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? <laughs> Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it, it basically just happened. <laughs> uh, the internet! I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from double-digit father account. What? Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona. Oh, he's sending me bad puns in a goofy font. It's probably Sans. Yes. The computer's under that browser. is open to a social media site. Okay, leave? What's this? There are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me. Sometimes. Look inside, yes. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. <laughs> it's on the bookshelf. 
Well, that book's one of my favorites. Advanced puzzle construction for the critical minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. <laughs> the ending always gets me. <laughs> Dude, this whole freaking house is so funny. We didn't even got on the date yet. Isn't that flag Nito? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world? Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think the humans must have descended from skeletons. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes. Action figures. A great reference for the theoretical battles. He's such a little kid, man. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to su loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right, Santa. <laughs> Damn it. And finally, your race car bed. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long hallway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, well, that's just a dream. So, instead I cruise while I snooze. Yes. Okay, is it daytime? So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start that date? Begin the date, yes. Yes. Okay, dating start. <laughs> Dating. Start. There's no music yet. Here it is. Here we are! On our date! I've actually never done this before. But do not worry! You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. <laughs> I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. Press the C key on the keyboard for the dating hood. <laughs> Saturday. Oh my god, what is all this? Reel it in, population crime? The dog? That's a dog dar. Set egg? Okay. Wow, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Oh god. He has no Yeah, we're ready for second base. Step two. Ask them on a date. Newman! I, the great papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yes. Really? Oh, I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three. Put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandage of ha that bandage hanging off of you? You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No. Could it be? You wanted to take me from the very beginning. Sure. God! No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! <laughs> no! No! Your dating power! No! Look at his fucking date power! Yeah. <laughs> Don't think you've bested me yet! Tension's going up in time. <laughs> I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating! And I never will! I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Cool <laughs> dude! What do you think of my secret style? I love it! No! A genuine compliment! <laughs> However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further, unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Move to inspect with Z. How do I move? Okay. What about right here? The shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip. All articles of clothing can be improved this way. <laughs> What about your face? My hat? My hat? My hat? <laughs> well, well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. Sure, I'll open it. 
Do you know what this is? Of course it's spaghetti, isn't it? <laughs> spaghetti. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right! But also wrong! This ain't plain old pasta! This is an artisan's work! Silken spaghetti finally aged in an oaken cask! <laughs> then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus! Human! It is time to end this! There's no way this could go any further! Sure, I'll eat it. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scratches up! The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking! And by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do! Oh! 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 <laughs> Human! <laughs> it's clear now! You're madly in love with me! Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you, I, Papyrus, I, of, boy, uh, is it hot in here or is it just me? Uh, oh, shoot, human, I, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I don't like you the way you like me, romantically, I mean, I mean, I mean, I tried very hard to. <laughs> I, th I thought it was because you flirted with me that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, then, on a date, feelings would blossom forth, and I would be able to match your passion for me. But, alas, I, the Great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And, but instead, by dating you, I've only drawn you deeper into my, your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. <laughs> How could I have done this to my dear friend? Dude, is he friend zoning me? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend, and I'll act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. <laughs> you even have lips. Because I don't even have lips. <laughs> and hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Well, I gotta go. <laughs> okay, now, I do know that there's a point further in the game where he does call you if you don't go on the date with him, because I played through this to the point where he called me. Like I said, I went a little bit farther ahead than episode three. And he says that he finds you by calling every single number in the phone book until he finds us instead of, like, the number exchange we just had. So it's pretty damn funny. <laughs> Where'd he go? Is he gone? Is he outside? Door's still locked. Papyrus, you can't just leave a girl on a date. What the hell, man? Is he out here? Papyrus! What is this bullshit? Oh my god, Papyrus just bailed on us. Okay, well, that was the most freaking hilarious thing I've ever seen. What do you think of that? Comment down below right now. What did you think of the date <laughs> with Papyrus? <laughs> Okay, well, this is part of the reason why I wanted to go ahead and make sure I take a lot more time exploring all the different hints and... I don't want to say cues that they give us. Is that the right word? I don't know. But I want to make sure I explore all these things that are happening because it's freaking hilarious! So let's see what's over here, huh? We got some crystals on the ground. Can I touch them? No, they're just... They're just pretty little crystals going jingly jangly up on the ground. No, oh, can't touch those either. Damn. Okay. Okay, so I- flowers are bad, right? Like, I thought I was supposed to be not supposed to trust flowers. Yo, are you sneaking out to save her, too? Awesome. She's t she's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey! Don't tell my parents I'm here. Here, 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 here. What about you, dude? This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing I'd ever heard over and over. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing I'd ever heard over and over. What about this? Okay! I'm ready when you are. No? Okay. We'll save here. 
The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Save. Yes. Sup, Sans? What you doing, buddy? <laughs> what? You haven't seen a guy work two jobs before? <laughs> Fortunately, <laughs> two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. <laughs> I'm gonna go to Grubby's. You wanna come? Obviously. So now this is the thing. Like, I wanna go to these things now because I don't wanna skip out on them. I feel like that'd be a major waste. <laughs> well, if you insist, uh, I'll pry myself away from my work. <laughs> okay, let's go, Sans. <laughs> Over here, I know a shortcut. <laughs> Oh wow, that was a shortcut. <laughs> Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, hey, everyone. Hey, <laughs> hey, Sans. Hey, oh, pff, wrong voices. <laughs> Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hi, Sansy. Hey, Sans. Weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? <laughs> no, <laughs> I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. <laughs> you might be thinking of brunch. <laughs> here, get comfy. God damn it, Sans! Ah! <laughs> Oops, I'll chase it down. Sometimes, sometimes we don't put whoopee cushions in the seats. Anyway, let's order. <laughs> what do you want? Fries or a burger? Ooh. Oh, a burger sounds really good in my mouth right now. <laughs> hey, that sounds pretty good. <laughs> hey, Groby, we'll have a double order of burg. <laughs> Why is he sweating? Is he sweating? <laughs> so what do you think of my brother? So uncool. Eh, he's pretty cool. He's, he's cool in his own way. <laughs> of course he's cool. You'd be cool, dude, <laughs> if you wore that outfit every day. You'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. I wonder if we're gonna take it off eventually. Oh my god. <laughs> At least he washes it. Dude, he did take it off. Oh my god, he took it off for us. <laughs> and by that, it means he wears it in the shower. <laughs> hey, Grubby. Thanks for the perk, bud. <laughs> Here comes the Grub. Want some ketchup? Yes. <laughs> bon appetit. You tip the ketchup. The cap falls off and all the ketchup in the bottle pours onto your food. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Forget about it. You can have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. Is he itching his ass? Sands! <laughs> anyway, cool or not, you gotta agree, Papyrus tries really hard. He does, he does try really hard. Like how he keeps being a part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard. <laughs> and he begged, uh, begged her to let him in. <laughs> of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. <laughs> but the next day, she woke up and saw him <laughs> still waiting there. <laughs> Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him more of your training. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's, it's a work in progress. <laughs> oh, yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Oh god, so serious now. <laughs> Have you heard of a talking flower? So you know all about it. <laughs> the echo flower, they're all over the marsh. <laughs> Say something to them, and they repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one else is around, <laughs> a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Ew! That sounds evil! <laughs> Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. <laughs> keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Oh god. Okay, so keep an eye out for the echo flower. I'm all- I'm all sketched out now. I'm not- I'm gonna, like- Oh god, we just talked to one, though. <laughs> well, that was a long break. <laughs> I can't believe I let you pull me away from work like that that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. T can you foot the bell? It's just- uh, sure, I got it. <laughs> just kidding. No, feel me. Put it on my tab. Thanks, Sans. By the way, I was gonna say something, but uh, <laughs> I forgot. Thanks. Thanks for the cliffhanger, guy. Is that it? What about the burgers? Can I touch the burgers? Burgers? No? What about you? We already talked. Sansy, come back and sit with me. Everything's so fun when you're around. Sans is interesting. He told me about all kinds of incredible foods, but despite his knowledge, he always orders the worst burger off the menu. Ha ha ha! What? God damn it. Okay, what about you, dudes? Anything about Sans? I like Sans. Sometimes he feeds the scraps of food under the table. Then his brother gets mad, but why? We're adults. We can handle it. What about you? Huh? Since when did you. Uh, uh, words. Since when did you. Fuck! Since when did you and Sans become friends? I don't like him. He loves to appear without moving. <laughs> <laughs> that guy. I forgot he hates movement. I gotta walk all the way back, Sans! You dick. How's it going, Sans? Let's hang out again sometime. Oh, that's all he's got? Okay, well, let's go.
Oh, hello, rocks. What does this say? This is a box. You can put an item in or take an item out. Why would you, though? You can't use items when they're in the real box. Sincerely, a box hater. <laughs> Do you have, like, a max inventory, though? Wouldn't that be useful there? Okay, let's see what's going on down here. Do a little bit of a floor and don't touch me, rocks. Okay, good. They're not going to touch me. They're fine. Oh, it's Neko Flower. But if I don't say anything, I can hear what it said, right? I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Okay, well, let's see what it is. Hello. Ah, there's a camera behind the waterfall. Oh, that's a little concerning. Oh, I feel like I'm being watched now. I'm definitely being watched now. Okay, can I swim? Okay, good. Go oh, fuck rocks. Oh, God damn it, rocks. Okay, here we go. That was kind of creepy. So, oh. Man, I hate it when they use the shadows like that. That's almost always bad news, isn't it? Papyrus! How's it going, buddy? <laughs> Hi, Undyne! I'm, I'm here to report with my, my daily report! <laughs> uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? D did I fight them? Uh, yeah, yeah, yes! Uh, yeah, of course I did! I fought them valiantly! Uh, what? Did I capture them? Uh, well, well... No! I tried very hard on dying, but... But in the end... I failed! What? what? You're gonna take the human soul by yourself? But, but I'm dying! You don't have to destroy them, you see? You, you see? Mm -hmm. I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Oh no! So that's Undyne, huh? Undyne's a major bitch. Oh shit. Undyne's spooky looking! No, no! Oh. You sound heavy. Whoa! You sound dangerous! Holy shit, get that away from me! Can I move? Is moving a thing? Maybe I shouldn't move at all. Maybe you won't know. Clueless! I think. Or he's coming to eat me later. Oh god. So I thought monsters were nice. I thought I could have been the jackass. Why is that one trying to kill me? Oh, did you see the way she was staring at you? That, that was awesome. I'm so jealous. What, what did you get her attention, huh? <laughs> Come on, let's go watch her be up to bad guys. <laughs> <laughs> Don't break your nose, kid. <laughs> A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. Ooh, that one doesn't say it fills you with determination. Ooh. Well, the other ones have so far, I'm pretty sure. Okay, what is this? When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will spout. Oh, okay, so I could take you and go boop. And then I could probably just pick all these up and when they're in a line. But seriously, I thought all the monsters were supposed to be super nice. Why is this one such a major bitch? <laughs> okay, so now I want to do at least one battle of every single monster. Not every monster, but like every one that we run into. Because what I did before is I would always skip them, skip them, skip them because I was like, well, okay, I'm just wasting time in the let's play. But these are really funny, so I want to go ahead and look at Aaron. What's up, Aaron? Aaron, the seahorse has a lot of horsepower. God damn it. All of his attacks are harder to dodge at the bottom of the box. Okay. Check all you want, baby. <laughs> at the bottom of the box. So if I just stay up here, I'm good. Okay. Smells like a muscle farm. <laughs> okay, well, what if I flex? You flex. Ugh! Aaron flexes twice as hard. Attack increases for you too. Flexing contest? Okay, flex more, winky face. Whoa, get away. Okay, so yeah, they- Ow, oh, fuck. Maybe I didn't suck, this wouldn't be hard. Okay. Aaron's what? Ready for your next flex. Oh, uh, bring it, Aaron! You flex even harder! Aaron flexes thrice as hard. Attack increases for you too. <laughs> nice! I won't lose though, winky face. <laughs> A freaking winky face. He's such a creep. Why do people wink like that, man? Aaron is ready for your next flex. Ah! Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. You won! <laughs> yeah! Good job, team! Poof! How do I read that sign? That sign seems pretty useless. Oh, oh I bet you I can take plants and put them down here. I kind of remember. I want to read that sign. Hey, Squeaky. I'm going to take you and put you over here. And then I'm gonna go take this other one and put that over there. So I'm just gonna do this real quick. Oh, dude, listen to the music. Ooh. Okay, what should we got here? Sign? Congratulations! You failed the puzzle. Fuck you! <laughs> okay, so I need to solve this puzzle. 
And that looks like they only fit three each all the way down. Oh, I bet you I know what I do. I bet you I bring them up this way. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Look at how good I am at video games today, guys. I've been sleeping a lot more lately. I am on my mark, feeling sharp, feeling good. So let's go ahead and put our last little plant over here. And I'll stick that little bad boy up on there. There we go. We got this little flower bridge, everybody. Ring, ring. Huh. Oh, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? Okay, so he does say it. It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. <laughs> so, uh, what are you wearing? I'm, I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing some gross bandage. Is that true? Are you wearing a gross bandage? Uh, no. So you aren't wearing a gross bandage. Got it. You're my friend, so I trust you 100%. Have a nice day. Is he going to tell Undyne on me? Ah, oh, okay, there's Echo Flowers here. I kind of want to listen to these, actually. A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes into stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now, all we have are these sparkling stones in the ceiling. Oh. So people don't know what stars are anymore, maybe. Oh. This is the wishing room. Okay. Interesting. Thousands of people wishing together cannot be wrong. The king will prove that. And isn't the whole point of this to, like, meet up with the king so he can open up the door in between humanity and monsternity? I don't know the word. <laughs> Come on, see us make a wish. Uh-oh. Who we got here? Washua waffles, shuffles up? Uh. Uh. What's up? Washua is a humble germaphobe seeks to cleanse the whole world. Hmm, whistle has a clean tweet. A little bird. Oh god, oh god, I'm dead. Oh, I'm fine. He got a little birdie in his head. Ha! <laughs> you little rubber ducky. Washua is friends with the little bird. Washua? Washua? Well, if you're a germaphobe, you like to be cleaned, right? Or if I touch it, you'd geek out. Clean. You ask Washua to clean you, it hops around excitedly. Green means clean! <laughs> oh, oh shit. Give me it. Oh, dude. Is that HP? Nice! Washua's looking for some good, clean fun. Can I get- Oh, I can let you go. Perfect! Okay. This way I talk to this one? I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. What's the telescope doing here? Let's look. Oh, oh, I can look around. Check wall. Okay. Is that all you want me to see is check wall? Okay. Well, I can go check your wall, baby. Let's go talk to this flower real quick. Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. <laughs> is that papyrus? <laughs> Up where it goes. Oh, so I can just check. Oh, I can just check this wall. Okay. Can I can't go down here? Okay, what do these say? Ancient writing covers the walls. You can just make out the words, the war of the humans and monsters. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed they had nothing to fear. Humans are so unbelievably strong, it would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the soul power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it's the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist beyond the human body even after death. Oh god. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable power. Oh god. It's, a, it's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Oh, I wish you could see it. So what is this? A monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. Does that mean that Undyne wants my soul to like do nasty things? Does Undyne have bad intentions, man? I mean, that'd be the impression you'd be under, right? Oh god, creepiness again. Undyne, stay away! Ah! Hi! Hi, Undyne, how's it going, you bitch? Okay, don't touch me. No touchy, Undyne. No touchy. What is even under that creepy mask of yours, huh? You look ugly. Alright, I'm going up here. Whoop. Can't touch this. Oh, he almost touched it. Dude, I'm kicking ass. Look at these dodges. Look at these jukes. Boop. Bowock. That was close. Woo. Dude, can't touch this. Dan it. Dan it. Dan it. Dan it. Can't touch this. Dan it. Dan it. Dan it. Dan it. Can't touch this. Dan Ah! I'm okay. I'm okay, I think. I don't know where I am anymore. Oh, God. Oh, God. This is creepy. again. <laughs> Thanks, kid. Thanks for the cover. 
Oh god. Can I leave? Oh, I can move. Okay, let's go. I'm leaving. <laughs> What's out here? Nothing? I can't move anymore. <laughs> Look at how excited he is! Yo, did you see that? I'm done, just... Touched me! Oh, I'm never washing my face ever! Okay, ew. Man, you are unlucky. If you were standing just a little bit to the left, oh, yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see you again. <laughs> oh, he falls over every time. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? This cheese has been here so long, a long ma a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Okay, what's the deal with these mice? I don't get that. They're like everywhere, and these cheeses are everywhere. Am I actually going to see one of these mice? Squeak. <laughs> That's funny. Knowing the mouse made one day extract of the cheese from the magical crystal, it fills you with determination. Okay. Well, what are we on for time here? Okay, well, let's go talk to Sanzi boy here. And then I think we can call an episode, because we've been playing for a little bit here. Let's see here. What's up, Sans? <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. <laughs> it's normally around 50,000 Gs for this premium telescope. <laughs> but since I know you can use it for free. <laughs> How's about it? Sure. I don't see anything. Okay. <laughs> Damn it, Sans! <laughs> Damn it, Sans! You got us! <laughs> All the jokes, man. All the jokes. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? See, they don't know what stars are. Are you a star? See, I mean, he looks like a little one, right? So he doesn't know what a star is. That's so wicked. That's so wicked. Oh, how's it going, ice cream? I relocated my store, but there's still no customers. Oh, it's you! Unfortunately, I have thought of a solution! Punch cards! Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. Once you have three cards, you can trade for a free ice cream. Mmm! That'll be sure to get the customers to come back. An ice cream and a free frozen treat that warms your heart. Just 25G. Here we go. Cool! What's this? The ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors, you idiot! You idiot! Oh my god! What a dumbass! Okay, well we're gonna go ahead and this episode here. Really been liking this game so far. Really glad I'm playing it again. I think it's gonna be a ton of fun. I gotta make sure that I find everything and I at least try to find everything. That I don't obviously miss something super cool. I've been trying to talk to everybody. Let me know what you guys think about this, experiencing all these things. I think it makes the game super funny because, because the game is super funny. So, all that aside, if you like this, go ahead. Smash that like button, give the, give the video some internet points. How many internet points can we get, guys? And go ahead and subscribe if you have not already. That way you can see more Undertale as we release it. Hope you're having an awesome day. Thank you guys very much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video, the next Undertale that we do around here. Mwah, mwah, mwah. It's so big! Look at it! Oh my god! No, it's coming! No! <laughs> How's it going, everyone? My name is Swim Point, and welcome to Agario 3D. Somebody went ahead and made a 3D.